His name is Freddy. He's a three day event horse. So he's trimmed up. We're just trying to find a, a shoe that fits him pretty well. We'll shape it up and nail it on. Well, I grew up on a trail guide service in the Great Smoky Mountains National Park. And so my dad and my uncles would shoe those horses. You know, when I was a small kid, I wasn't really allowed in the barn at that time. Naturally, I had to become obsessed with that since I wasn't allowed to do it. And, uh, you know, it's just been something I've kind of been obsessed with for a long time. So for this, we'll actually, you know, shape it to the, the shape of this particular foot. Move the clip into the angle of the hoof wall. So with this, all we're doing is just kind of turning out the end of the heel to kind of just give him a little bit of, you know, caudal or plantar extension. So now we get it as level as possible and we'll take it to the foot and see how it fits. This is a process known as hot fitting. Um, it's a painless procedure to the horse. It allows us to shape the shoe while it's hot. And as long as it's hot, we can get a more exact, more uniform, more pretty shape. Horseshoes are traditionally attached with nails anywhere from four to eight. It goes behind the wall, through the wall and out of the wall. And then we fold it over, you know, which is called a clinch, which is what will actually ultimately hold the shoe on. If done up properly, it's a very safe, very secure way of applying a shoe. Again, it's, it's painless to the horse if it's done properly. I've actually learned a great deal from being here around vets and uh, vet students actually teach you a ton because they don't let you do anything without asking why. And so you have to stop, think about it and explain exactly what you're doing and why you're doing it. So that was a huge, huge learning experience to me instead of just going about your everyday.